quite glad that they didn't get into my tattoos because that would suck having a big hole in the middle of my tattoo. So in the last episode, we extracted a bot fly. This time I'm gonna try and actually get video footage of the whole extraction process. Welcome to Wildcard Adventures. So I'm gonna take the uh, super glue off of the second one. It's been on there for a few hours now. Ouch. It might actually pull the bot fly right out with it. Is it coming out with it? I'm going to say it did not come out with it. Let's do the push method. There he is. He's taking a breath. Do the push method. Do the push. Do the push. Same way. There we go. We got him. We got him. Oh, that one's bigger. Ah, that one's way bigger. Oh, oh. And we've got a successful bot fly extraction. Oh man, that sucked. <laughs> that one was longer. And now you need some alcohol. I'll wipe that first. Wipe it because I want to make sure that the hole is empty and there, there aren't more because I saw the tail coming out in three or four different directions earlier and I just want to make sure that it was just that one looking for air and not like three or four different ones. There we go. So you can see all the little spines on it. Oops. So that one was quite a bit bigger than the other one. So just for size comparison, this is the first one. And that's the second one. The second one's quite a bit bigger, quite a bit rounder, and way longer. So I'd say the second one that came out was probably the first one that was hatched, first egg that's hatched. So what happens is mosquitoes get the eggs of these laid on them by the actual female bot fly. And then when you get bit by the mosquito, the eggs kind of fall off and land on your skin. And then, well, then you get a bot fly in your skin. This has been a SpaceX production. Graphics from Wildcard Adventures were made with these four